Repent now! <laughs> Repent now! We are at LA Comic Con. No, I am excited, but it's a lot. Yeah. I'm overstimulated already. We're not dressed as Star Wars today. We're dressed as Evie and Rick O'Connell from The Mummy. Ashley looks phenomenal. Thank you. I'm prisoner, Rick O'Connell. We had, we had to figure out some a costume that would accommodate your name. Yeah. What Star Wars cosplays could have been? Qui-Gon Jinn. I could do a Qui-Gon Jinn. But we're here at the LA Comic Con. We're going to be exploring today. We're going to be looking for treasures today because we're dressed in our mummy costumes. As usual, looking for Star Wars at the convention. That's one of our favorite things to do. What else do you think we're going to be looking for? I'm looking for friends. Friends. There's a lot of faces I haven't seen in a really long time. So I'm excited to see friends. So we're doing a big Marvel shoot on the stairs. This is a very popular thing that a lot of the cosplayers will do is gather these big group photos because it's just so much more epic to see everybody's work together. Amazing. And you even look like him too. Yeah, good cop van. My gosh, it's the first one I've really seen. And he, he looks like him too. I'm behind buyers already. Gotta figure out how to get into the convention. Evie, can you get me out of here? Oh, I wasn't ready. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Evie, you gotta get me out of here. Do you know the way to Hamanatra? You wanna know the way to Hamanatra? Do you wanna know the way to Hamanatra? Tell me. Do you wanna know? Yes. Then get me the hell out of here. <laughs> he says it, right? Get me the hell out of here. Then get me the hell out of here, lady. You kiss me and then you tell I me. I can't pull can't. you forward. We just watch it this morning. I can't yeah, we're just recreating the scene for the mummy. Brian, Brian going outside of Star Wars and it clearly shows he's not familiar. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Another Mandalorian. I feel like I've seen like 10 Mandalorians so far and they all look awesome in their own way, which is cool. Uh, we're finally at a convention. Yay! Yay! We're back, Fly Crew. We're at a comic book convention. We haven't been to one of these since 2019 for San Diego Comic Con. Sorry. Oh, Ashley already sees stuff. <laughs> Great Star Wars bag. Yeah, oh my god, totally. Ooh. And I have it in two sizes. That's it's awesome. Cool. I love that. Take it. Oh, look, it's got a zipper in the back. Actually. This is totally Rick style. I mean, I think you should get that. For bounding, yeah. too? Oh my gosh, it's so sick. Nice. It's pretty cool. Is that Velcro? It's like a Bat 2 Batman belt. That's perfect. There you go. I love this. So Okay, I've got that's the smaller one. There's a little bit bigger one down there. Okay. I like that. Mm -hmm. In the back of your pouch, you'll see FMLG. Oh, uh, okay. okay. The second yeah. we walked in, we bought stuff. We bought these pouches. We're wearing them already. We also met up. Our good friend Julian is here. Hi. Uh, <laughs> and we're also here with Natalie. It is, it is packed here at the convention. I think everybody is thirsty for a convention again. It's been so long since anybody's been to a comic book convention. Again, we haven't been to one since San Diego Comic Con when we did our Star Wars episode. It's a little busy. It's a little chaotic here right now. I'm a little... I like this one a lot. A walk in the woods. <laughs> a walk in the woods? Yes! I does smell it. good. It does smell pretty good. Oh wow. <laughs> We've walked into the convention and already like stopped at two booths and we're already buying things and both of the places are not really comic book related. It's just like cool craftsmen. So we're at a candle company right now. Toe or folding? Toe to folding. It came with this cool toe. I'm going to put everything in it. Oh good. That's what caught my eye. I got the candle and it comes with a metal oh, D20 dice so inside. Oh that's that awesome. Right? We're going to have to start playing D&D &D now. It's been a while. It's been a while, is right. I've never, never played D and D. I gotta be honest with you guys. Well, found some Star Wars figures. That's usually what you find at most booths. Some fun Star Wars artwork we just saw. If any of you guys love Baby Yoda, there's a giant Grogu here. A giant inflatable Grogu. That's the biggest Grogu I've ever seen. It's Baby Yoda, everybody! They need this for the Christmas decorations. Oh, just completely. Something. Just, just on our front yard. Just completely blocking the house and <laughs> making it so private. This is just something simple. If you have one thing. One thing. That's the one thing. Yeah, you, wanna, you just want the one giant Grogu. And it's okay to be extra. Yeah. If you have one thing, be extra. Yes. He's been training. He got a little bit bigger since we last saw him. If you've never been to a convention, there's so many different ways to express your fandoms. Some of us like to dress up like Ashley and I today. People like to bring their cars. We have a bunch of awesome movie cars. We have Godzilla behind me. There's so much stuff everywhere. I like this one. The probe droid that Darth Maul sends out when he's looking for, uh, for Anakin. Which one do you like, Ashley? That one. You don't, you don't want Daddy Obi-Wan? I do like Daddy. 
wrong with these stores? Oh, that's fun. That's a fun way to do it. So there's a Life Day comic that came out, guys. We need to pick this up and read this. There's though. actually a variant covers, too. There's a variant? Oh, man. Yeah. That's so fun. I forgot to read those. I saw those when we were doing Life Day things on Batu. There's also some other fun stickers from uh, Sword and Weston. Whetstone. I said Weston. <laughs> Sword and Whetstone. And so I had some extra. Well, that's fun. I like that Hello There sticker, too. You got stars? Oh, I like those. I like those. Yeah, it's very, they're, they're black, so they go with my stuff. <laughs> yeah, I love it. Oh, amazing. And the toaster. Oh. <laughs> it's a toaster. Niagara Falls, Frankie Angel. Never seen Scrooge costumes. Stop. Natalie and Ashley are like, oh my god, it's Scrooge. If you haven't seen Bill Murray and Scrooge, awesome holiday movie. <laughs> this is what we love. People having fun with their outfits. Yay. Amazing. Probably the best costumes we've seen so far. Very original. Whoa. With the Hot Topic booth, they have the Book of Boba Fett poster. It's like the Yoda backpack, but it's a child. Have you seen that? Oh my god. He has a bit of space. As you can see, he's an exclusive. How many snacks can we hold in there? Well, he can fit several frogs, several cookies, you know, a bit of everything. Like, you can fit a phone in here, like, some snacks. <laughs> but it does have some space, yes. And it's a San Diego Comic Con 2020 exclusive, but since we didn't have a Comic Con. <laughs> oh, yeah. Are you ready? No, yeah. Oh, okay. This is so cute. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to take that. Wait, look yeah. at the ear. Okay. Sorry, this one's dirty. No, no, this is just a display. Don't worry. No. Okay. I was like, wait. We'll never give you a dirty child. Don't worry. Don't worry. Uh, look, at he's got his little woodland feet. In the back, Scott. Yep, yep. Which one's cuter, Flight Crew? Would you pick Grogu or Wicked over here? Answer in the comments below. Which one do you like better? Me, personally, I go with this one. You go with that one, Natalie? Yeah. You have so many bags now. What are you trying to say? <laughs> <laughs> Lord Vader! First Lord Vader I've seen today. BB-8, you look beautiful! <laughs> BB-8 is a little blinked out, it's got some eyelashes going on. No, no, no! What are you doing, Mando? BB-8 said, no, no, no. <laughs> Whenever you see a droid rolling around, there's always a handler with their hand in their pocket somewhere controlling it. Our hero, Luke Skywalker! Are you here to save the day? Yep. <laughs> the rescue. You're the first Luke I've seen today. You look awesome. Thank you. Thank you so much. Like, we know you guys all like lightsabers. Chris has got the ultimate Master Luke Saber. I, I saw the video, yeah, you're showing off your Anakin lightsabers. Yes. I love it. Flight crew members! <laughs> Woo! So we're over here at the Sideshow booth. Wow. Oh, look how he's floating. How did I do that? Is it stuck on his cape? Oh, yeah. It's got to be on his cape. That's smart. So tricky. What do we got over here, Ashley? Wow. Look at that rancor. Mando is never far away. The child is here. Man, that Mando is so good with the child, too. IG-11! Woo! Nurse and protect. Nurse and protect. Nurse and protect. And there's that cocky scout trooper. He had what's coming to him. Get him, get him, get him! <laughs> punch your little butt. Punch your little butt. <laughs> what is it? Oh, that's a, well, that's a vintage... Death Star Space oh, Station. Too. Yeah, wow. That's awesome. That's very cool. That's so cool. They have a couple uh, vintage pieces over here. Got a TIE Fighter. Oh, this is quite a collection in here. Oh, man. The original Han Solo Kenner Blaster. I've got this one in orange. This was my favorite toy. Very cool booth. They have a lot of vintage Star Wars action figures. They have the original Han Solo Blaster. They have a Stormtrooper Blaster. All the original cool toys. Pretty cool to see. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. It's the custom figures. They're like five bucks. I'm like, I need those. That's cool. 
I'm having trouble today. I can't tell if I keep seeing new Mandalorians or if I keep seeing the same Mandalorian because they all look so good. I've seen so many. So cute. Yeah. You're a Mandalorian too, I can see. You've got, you've got the dark saber and you've got the helmet. More Grogu's and Mandalorian. I think Mandalorian is probably one of the most popular costumes that I've seen so far this year. Yeah. You look amazing, dude. Thank you. Opening ceremony. Wow, that's pretty cool. Oh, I want the real thing. So we're, we're buying prints that are going to be in our Disneyland themed living room that you guys saw in our, our home tour that we've done. We've been wanting to make it feel a little more Disney. Because over at the booth with Bob Gurr, he's one of the legendary Disney Imagineers. And it can't wear out. <laughs> I love the Honda Mansion. Like, it is one of my favorites. Well, but yeah, it does break down. Haunted Mansion the other way around. I know! <laughs> it's, the most, it's the most coffee. It has more wheels than anything. Really? One day I apologized to the mechanic. I said, I'm, I'm sorry guys, this, I never believe it's going to have this many wheels. And the guy said, it's okay. They all run the same direction all day long. The King Tut is classic. Yeah, there's um, a made-up fifth one in the mummy. So this booth is really fun. They actually have a lot of Egyptian artwork pins. Totally goes with our theme today with doing the mummy. Absolutely. If you purchase three or more, they're ten. Fun crossover. Disney so and Di Star Wars together. Disney, Star Wars, and My Little Pony. Yes. I think was the other one. I like the Elsa, Mando, and the Anna Boba. I didn't even pick up that that was an Elsa. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's awesome. Elsa and Anna. That's true. Oh my gosh, it is Elsa and Anna. That's so cool. <laughs> Thank you. I gotta get one of these. Yeah, Dude, that's so fun. I have a crystal concert. That's pretty fun. I know this is for the uh, Ted Lasso show, but I like to believe. Yeah. I'm about to believe. I appreciate you stopping by. Yeah, I'm glad we saw you. Have Thank you very much, you. Justin. We love these. All your costumes are wonderful. <laughs> so how's, how's your loot bag doing, Ashley? We'll catch a game. I love yeah. it so much. You've got so much loot. Okay. Yeah. I know. You've got, look, look at all these bags you've got. Yeah. It's treasures. <laughs> you've been treasure hunting all day. I know. <laughs> I love supporting everybody here. Yeah. I always feel like, I want to support you, and I want to support you. So many of these artists, again, haven't been able to do these conventions, and like, they make a lot of their living off of these events. So. We're happy to be back here. We're happy you guys are hanging out with us today at the convention as well. Some fun lightsaber keychains. Hello. Hello. What'd you get? I got a hat. You got a hat? Yeah. A little it's just a little, a little beret. Oh, hey, 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 what's up? <laughs> Hi, babe. Hi. Battle ready. Very ready. Very ready. <laughs> oh, there it is. Coming for you, Ashley. I know. Coming for me. <laughs> yeah, just my body. <laughs> Do you think you would survive, or would you be one of the ones to die first? For the mommy? Yeah. I'd put yeah. up a fight. No, I, 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 <laughs> it looks like a Jawa, but it's not a Jawa. No, they say martini. That's what they martini. say. Martini. Martini. That's what they oh say. Oh my gosh. Good. That is so cute. For, for legal reasons. It's very cute. Should I get one? Which one? They make, uh, they make great Christmas. Um, I like this one. This one? We'll do that one. Oh, we got a Jawa. Well, no, it's not Jawa. No, it's a, For it's legal not. reasons, he's not a Jawa. And they say martini instead of utini. So are you happy with your Jawa? Hey, uh, Flecker, we need a name for our little Martini Jawa. Maybe his name's Martini. Maybe his name's Martini. We don't even need a name. <laughs> this time we've named him ourselves. Thank you, Flecker. We've appreciated your input. <laughs> oh, these are fun. oh my gosh, these are beautiful. Oh, I wish I had pierced ears. You do? Yes. Do you like those? I do like those. Which would you get if you were going to get one? It's a set. It's a set? Yeah, you can get these ones? So many. You got Ray's as well. Yeah, I really, really want those ones? So you're going to get Ray and which one? Maybe Dark Ray? <laughs> yeah, maybe one side could be light, one side could be dark. It's a bow caster. It's fine, it's like a repaint. <laughs> what did I say? There's so many Mandalorians today. That was. Great, he was just cruising along. I like how he had his like Instagram on his like little, on the, the child. Oh, that's smart. I think he maybe wins. But I think this guy wins for cuteness, Martini. I'm a sucker for a stuffed animal. I know. You immediately are like, I'm buying it. Cool. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> oh, I gotta clean the lens off from that one. Flight crew, that was awesome. That was so gross. I can't believe I just found them. The droid builders are here. Lots of amazing droids. We got Chopper. R5 unit. Or you have social anxiety. We know you guys love droids. We saw this little guy outside earlier. He's amazing. Wow. Look at all the lightsabers he's got up there. Whoa. This is one of the coolest droids I've ever seen. Slick. Wow. Whoa. Oh my gosh. What? <laughs> well, you were one slick dude, I gotta say. It's just not like a con where there's a corner that's uh, to accessories. We have more. No, but you can build one yourself if you join one of these clubs. They can teach you how to make your own to work. work. I did not know how I did not notice that. And I love it too. They have the little evil BB-8 unit that you saw in The Last Jedi. Wow. Love your custom style that you did too with your helmet. That's cool. Very cool. The Cosplay National Championship. Yeah! Holy cow, the whole floor has done come up in here. I am so excited to see a quarter of your faces. I am the Geek Gatsby Bernie Bregman. It is my pleasure to be back here for like the eighth year in a row. In to create this strike text. May the force be with you. Thank you, Nicole. Creating a reimagined version of Godzilla. If it were to be a human character, and everything was built on top of a cardboard frame, he attempted to compete with Eclipsa in 2019. Custom built parasol that has magical effects. <laughs> and it helps to fill in all the seams. Even, check that out. It took six months of painstaking work to make this thing. Oil level work detailing, articulated wings, check it out. As a living saint, her wingspan is 12 and a half feet. Incredible. Well, flight crew, uh, we just watched some of the costume contests at the end of the day. We're pretty tired. Yeah, that was a lot. Ashley found so much today. Yeah, I wasn't planning on it, but <laughs> it was something I was looking forward to doing here. And everybody else, we got everybody else here too. We got Jen and Natalie and Jason earlier here too. We're all heading out. It was a really fun day. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let us know what some of your favorite costumes were. Your favorite things are that you saw today. I had so much fun. I did too. It was a good first con back. First, first con, wait, first con. In a while. In a while. <laughs> <laughs> the sun has set on LA Comic Con. That is it. The con is over, everybody. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody. Happy exploring. <laughs> <laughs>